When Jamie Traxel dialed the phone, she wasn't sure what she was going to hear. New Gophers softball coach who was hired last July after former coach Jessica Allister left for Stanford. Knew there had been speculation about whether Big Ten Player of the Year Kendall Linderman would stay. Linderman was the first player Traxel called after signing her contract. And the sophomore catcher immediately put her mind at ease. I told her I love this school. Linderman recalled Wednesday. I could never see myself leaving this team behind. I just wanted to come back out here with a chip on my shoulder and get back to work at Minnesota. That commitment, Linderman said, helped her and her teammates withstand a rocky start to the season before surging into this week's Big Ten tournament in Madison, Wisp. In the first 30 games under Traxel, the Gophers went 17-13 and fell out of the national rankings. The Fortitude, along with Linderman's bat and pitcher Amber Fies' arm propel. Them to 19 victories in the past 21 games, giving them the low. Two seed in the tournament and a bye into Friday's quarterfinal against host Wisconsin. The Gophers finished second in the Big Ten with a 17-4 record and Linderman repeated as the winner of the conference's top award. In the past 21 games, they have outscored opponents 151-14, so the two-time defending tournament champions are brimming with confidence, with the coaching change and eight new players. They had a lot of things to work through, Traxel said. These kids have fought for each other and for what they want, there's a lot of pride in this group. Piece by piece, they just kept putting it together and they can still get better. The Gophers, 36-15, enter the tournament hitting point 287, fourth in the Big Ten, and the team earned run average of 1.82 is second behind Michigan. Linderman is tied for the league high in homers with 19, while Fizza ranks second in the Big Ten in victories, 25-era, 1.48, strikeouts, 216, and Shutouts 9. Linderman proudly pointed out that no players transferred out of the program when Alistair left for her dream job at her alma mater. The former coach instilled a culture based on devotion to the program and to each other, which served the Gophers well as they moved on without her.